Where are the Bears stronger than any team in this division? I think outright it comes down to one simple answer. Would you rather have this guy than this guy? And I think position-wise, there's the quarterback position in the NFC. There's not a single team that wouldn't prefer to have Justin Fields than their guy. So I guess if we're talking about the strengths of a team, I don't think the Vikings for a second. If you're trading Fields for Cousins straight up, Goff for Fields, and or Jordan Love for Fields, I don't think there's a single team in the division that says no. Very fair. I have to agree with you 100%, um, which is crazy. <laughs> it's just kind of crazy. Bears might have the best quarterback in the NFC North. The last time you heard that. Yeah. You know? Wide receiver-wise, um, definitely I mean, the Je- Vikings are Justin stronger. Justin Jefferson, yeah. That, that Vikings are stronger. Stud. At running back, I would say... Well, hold on. Lot. Who else is stronger? Or, or do the Packers have a better wide receiver core? Do the Lions have a better wide receiver core? I think the Lions might with Amon Ross St. Brown. The Lions might. And then Jamison Williams. Well, he's suspended, but... What about Christian Watson and the Packers? That's where it's a toss-up, depending on how this year goes. But I would I would take DJ Moore, Darnell Mooney, and Chase Claypool over those guys. Yep. They okay. might have the Packers might have the fourth best. Okay. Tight ends. Uh, TJ Hawkinson probably wins by himself. He got paid a ridiculous amount of money. He better earn it. Um, the Packers, debatably, they just drafted two tight ends and. You know, they're young and hopefully they work out, but usually tight ends don't work out in the first year. And then uh, I honestly don't know who the Lions tight end is because they traded TJ Hawkinson. So uh, I'm going to say the Bears probably have the second best tight end core in the uh, NFC North. Okay, second or third, depending on how the Packers do, right? Robert T- Robert Tunyon would be starting on two of the four teams. That's true. That's true. Okay. Um, yeah. What about the general offensive line? Offensive line, I think Detroit's definitely the best. If everybody's healthy, I say Green Bay's the second best. The Vikings notoriously are bad, but middle middle bad. And then the Bears right now is a toss-up. So I would say they're the worst offensive line in the NFC by reputation. NFC North. NFC North. Yes, by, by reputation. reputation. By reputation. Yeah. Okay. Uh... And then, yeah, I mean, we could go through the defensive positions. We could just say defense as a whole. Who's, who do you think is the best defense in the NFC North? Ooh. Wow, there's so much moving parts. So I can't possibly say the Bears is the number one. No. That's that's not possible. No, we were about say, to pack that year. Right. I would say Lions, number one. Packers, two. And then the Vikings were very, very bad on defense as well last year. And I think they only got worse. So I'm going to take Bears at three, Vikings at four.